Colonel said the old watchtower should be near the falls. And we tell those soldiers to head home. I'll break my fall. There's the watchtower. I need to talk to their squad leader, Kiva. Damn machines keep coming. What? Are you Kiva? I am. And you. You're the Outlander who killed Regala's champion at the Embassy. Ram Squad was there. We saw your duel. Pavalo still owes me shards. Oh, thanks for the vote of confidence. Chaplain Jera sent me. It's time for you to go home. Jera's cracked then. There's no way our commander will allow us to leave our post. Not after our insubordination. Things have uh, changed at the Bulwark. Dakota won't be able to stop you. Really? Hey Josh, welcome. Just starting. All right then. The Spoilers alert. I'm far into the story. The Let me recall him. <laughs> That's odd. His echo always answers. One of us will have to go up. I yeah, I know who can go, will go, have to go up. Much appreciated. The start of the climb is just across the falls. Try not to break your neck, yeah? What's going on? Don't think We're moving out. Help. Back to the bulwark. You're shitting me. What about his echo? The outlander will check on it. There is a convoy there. Ah, uh, where am I on the map? Uh, this, this here. Ah, 
Ah, uh, that's one one way looking at it. I say that because some this people have a thing about spoilers. I myself don't care about them. I mean, it's my playthrough, my decisions anyway, so... I saw birdies there. Yep. Chain reaction. Okay, skills. As I mentioned, I maxed out the infiltrator skill. And this one here is very cool and powerful. Okay, back again. Oh yeah, that one. I remember that one. But this will be your first cauldron. Closer to the watchtower. Looks like I have to climb higher. Not gonna take much damage from the fire. I gotta take out these machines before I can look around. Watch now. They start fighting each other. I think I have... That was a new show about a year ago, right? About a guy who was connected to the... Moon God from the Egypt mythology.
side to this watchtower. That must be him. Okay. Job done. I love the way the actor was playing. At the same time, I can't say much about the show. It was not bad, but I think the actor was holding the whole thing. So, this skill, this skill right here, solves all your group problems. Whenever there are a lot of machines together, just use this. They kill each other, and besides, they take damage over time. So, very co good skill. I think I found what's left from the guy. Judging by these wounds, the Sky Drifter surprised him. At least it was quick. Eva sounded her horn. It's a different call from before. I'd better get back down to the watchtower and check on them. The watchtower's under attack. I need to get down there fast. Okay. Swooping into battle. Those machines are in for a surprise. Are they? One of the ten the Outlander glides. On birdies, deal with each other.
the show was great they did a lot of great acting at the same time there were there were those guys that were not nailing it <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed this battle and this is the combat skill that helps a lot in a multiple enemy situation. So pick this it up as soon as down? possible and max Actually, it out. Machine's got him. Works on humans too. I'm sorry. What? He was the first of the squad. Our best fighter. He's gone, Kiva. It's just the two of you now. Damn, Dakota. All we did was go to the embassy. Follow Chief Akaro's orders? A and what do we get for it? A death sentence dressed up as guard duty. All because Dakota has a vendetta against the Chief. Well, that ends now. Yeah. Thanks, Outlander. Here. This is for you. Pavalo! We're moving out. It's actually really difficult to pull out acting several differ different people, even two, in the same Dakota show at the same time. Maybe now I'll stop wasting lives over political agendas. Okay, let's go for the main quest. Do one piece of it. Man, it's not even close. Let's check this one first then. Uh, there is a show, Stargate, and one of the main character was, for a while, he was housing several, seven different people in him. And he did quite well, representing all of them. Among them was a child, too. And then there is this other episode that was widely referencing that. Uh, it was the same show, but the development of it, the this pigment would work well in armor. The next version, let's call it. So that next version, one of the characters was teleported out of a storage device made by not so friendly race nearby and he came out with the consciousness of him and a fellow soldier, a female soldier, but her body remained trapped inside, so technically he had to play a guy that had two consciousness inside of him. And he did quite well as well. It was incredibly well acted. I see you. So, at some scenes he was acting like a man, at other scenes he was acting like a woman, nailed the body language as well. And in other scenes he was acting like he was crazy. 
because of the two consciousness complaining to himself with himself etc Must have gotten there some other way. Okay. If you've never seen Stargate, I recommend it. The TV series and the movie. There is a fire there. Can okay, restock all. Ah, the name of the actor, just a second. I was thinking about him, David Hewlett. The name of the the second actor is David Hewlett. Uh, you can check online his performance as Rodney McCain is losing his mind because of a parasite. Parasite, and the other one when his his mind is merged with that of a female lieutenant. Let's see what's on top. The views are breathtaking. I definitely urge you go exploring. Okay, 
and there is the shelter. Hold on, AY. Hold for dear life. Imagine that you have to hold this as a parachute manually. So all your weight is on your hands holding. Okay, let's go Rocinante, Roach. Running on a mountain path, nothing scary. Yeah, this is a cool combination. Pretty much everything you study is aligned this way.
inside. But this is for high school still learning, right? It's not for university studies. If you're really into ancient Egyptian stuff, you love Stargate. I'm not joking about it. like we're not going to be friends. I need to get past these hostels and into the horns. Okay, equip stalker. Much better. Open. I Come see on, you. in case there's more of them. According to Gaia, it should be somewhere in these ruins. Let's say this series, you're gonna love them. For what I know, for what I know about you, so far, I think this is one of the series you're going to watch. It had for a long time 100% score on Rotten Tomato. Now it's slightly lower. And I stress slightly.
Another tall neck. Looks like some sort of old office complex. The greenhouse. Okay, welcome to the greenhouse. Welcome to the house of fun. Solutions industry leading biotech research facility. Agritech. Environmental remediation. Organic waste management. Whatever your company needs, here at the greenhouse, we'll help solve your problems. Naturally. A Ferro research facility. Organic waste. Was this the sewage system? Fragment. I had a dream which was not our dream. The bright sun was extinguished and the stars did wander darkling in the eternal space. Rayless and pathless and the icy earth swung blind and blackening in the moonless air. Morn came and went and came and brought no day. And men forgot their passions in the dread. Of this their desolation and all hearts were chilling into selfish prayer for light, and they did live by watch fires and the thrones, the palace of crowned kings, the huts, the habitations of all things which dwell, were burned for beacons, cities were consumed, and men were gathered round their blazing homes. To look once more into each other's face, happy were those who dwelt within the eye. Hmm. What, Ray? Can't get rid of the vines. Not yet, anyway. A little flower. Demeter should be right beyond that door. But those vines are blocking the way. Unless I can cut through them, I'm gonna need to find another way in. Alright. First game, in the first game, these flowers had poetry attached to them. Whenever you found one, you found a classic poem. Now I wonder if it will be the same. Science is a process of discerning patterns, finding a sense of order amongst the chaos. Never has th that been more pertinent than today, here at the greenhouse between the construction bots 
The strong wreckage from last night's storm, the hosts of protesters who don't even know the nature of our work. If we knew what it was we were doing, it would not be called research, would it, Albert Einstein? <laughs> I love this one, gotta write it down. <laughs> Just a second, finding paper and pen to write this down. <laughs> oh. There's no doubt that Ted Farrow is a business savant when it comes to robotic assistance, but does he grasp the science as well as the marketing? He and his board can sense what the world wants from a fashion app, but the choices they make now will determine whether millions starve here or a country falls into the void there. Great. At least there's a console. flowers here and the vines so maybe I can find a way to destroy them if I can find test station ivy One Marine, one Marine. 
Okay. There's a barbarian in the compound. She got past the lookouts. Find her, kill her, and bring her head to the lieutenant. Understood. I guess diplomacy is off the table. Read us as heroes. Camera. One cut at a time. Protect the site. Kill her. Imperial Guard? You ready for me? Hey! Take her up now! Kill the strangers. Body here. Keep your eyes open for trouble, okay? This time you die. Outlander! Protect the site! Kill her! We've got to hit her! I can't see her! She must be using cover! Yes, she's using cover. Take her off now! Cover that area! I think that's where she is. Put her down! With me, we have 
to find her. Left me no choice. Berserk Hunter are also now available. Perfect. To attack for a limited time. Nice. No sprinting for 10 minutes? So just regular regular run? Row? When do you start a timer? Special gear, black box, black box. I have to report those black boxes. Quests, skills. Yeah. It's gonna be a long fight if I start next. Pretty certain I can ambush you. Just run into the right bush. You keep playing these games. Okay, I'm not playing anymore. I really wish these people would have talked to me instead of trying to kill me. Okay, welcome to Camp Oak, summer camp, I suppose. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is why you first 
have a discussion before we start war. That door looks promising. Submit. Do as you will. I didn't want to fight your friends out there. They attacked me. If by death alone I can atone our trespass. Look, I'm not gonna kill you, okay? I just want to figure out what's going on. Where did you get that focus? Uh, I'm of the chosen people. The Quen? The ancestors left the power of the focus to us alone, the eye that reveals the legacy. The legacy, huh? The legacy? Uh, the truth. Now, it is in the darkness. And uh, the I can't places. show it on the map Among right the now. Ancient ashes and the bones of the I'll show it after. Waiting. You know, as a diviner, it is my task to seek it out for the good of my people. You're looking for data. Maybe we can help each other. What's your name? Alpha, second diviner of the Eastern Expedition. I'm Aloy. Why don't we start again? <laughs> the Quen? I've never heard of the Quen. Our lands lie across the Great Ocean. We haven't been here before. So why come now? Our homeland has been ravaged by freakish weather. Terrible storms and blistering droughts. The crops are failing. The people are starving. When we looked for answers, it was proposed that if we had the courage to cross the ocean to Legacy's landfall, then we might earn the knowledge we need to save our people. But so far, that knowledge has eluded us. She sounds like that a little bit. I agree. So, your people call this place Legacy's Landfall? No. Uh, landfall is where we arrived. To the west, in the shadows of the sunken city by the broken bridge. You mean San Francisco? Yes. You're well versed in the Legacy. It was a place of great importance to our ancestors. We had hoped to learn their secrets there, but so far that door remains closed. Even so, the data we discovered there has led us to this place. It might be our last chance. To find something that can save your crops and your people. Yes. If the ancestors will be generous to us once more. Where did you get your focus? So you said your ancestors left your tribe that focus. Yes. Thirteen diviners have possessed this one since it was discovered among the ruins in our homeland. I have their honored names committed to memory. So you have one, but none of the soldiers out there did. We each have a role to play. No, it is the diviners' purpose to seek out the legacy, interpret the wisdom of our ancestors for the good of all, and to keep it safe, so that no one but the diviners know how to use a focus. Not even the Imperial family, and certainly not soldiers. This so sounds like religious propaganda. At Landfall, a small group. Uh, back at home, a few dozen more. That's a guess. Uh, only the Overseers know for sure, and I am not of their rank. That's definitely a religious propaganda. Hello there, Reagan. How are you doing? So you call data from the ancient past the legacy? Yes. All that is not lost or forbidden. What does that mean? All that we are capable of reading and that which is permitted. Okay. I'm not sure I get it. That's fine. Um, so what do you use the data for? The greatest secrets are the ones that improve the lives of many. How to tend our crops, how to hold floodwaters back, or even... Across the ocean. Technology. That is what I seek here. 
technology that can help my people back home. Those soldiers, they opened fire on me without warning. Why? Uh, it is the duty of the Quen to seek out the legacy and defend it from the ignorant and envious. Not that you seem ignorant. <laughs> Back home, other tribes only mean us harm, and we were told the same was true here. Does that come from your legacy? The legacy is truth. But we have been known to misinterpret it. Oh, dear. I hope time and the wisdom of our ancestors will guide us down the correct path. Yeah. I hope so, too. I'm looking for a place in this facility called Test Station Ivy. Have you found any data that mentions it? No. Uh, but I did find something that looks like a map. Uh, but it was unreadable. Lost. Maybe I can make some sense of it. Uh, there. There's a lot of files here. <sighs> I've been through all of them. Look in the GH facility section. Like I said, a lost file. You can't see the map? You have no access. It's okay. It looks like your focus is an early model. The operating system won't be able to read any files created after the mid-2050s. But I could share them with you. Share them? Commence update. <laughs> you can see what is lost. And forbidden. Not lost, not forbidden, just a newer format. <laughs> there. Version 1.2, ladies and gentlemen. There. We've been here for a week trying to get deeper into the complex. The way has been blocked by rubble. Well, what about this tunnel? It looks like it unlocks from here. No. I thought these might be some kind of access controls, but I couldn't read enough data to make them work. Let's try with my focus, okay? I believe these consoles were meant to be operated in unison, but I'm not sure. Okay, let's see. We already have moderate but promising results. If I have seen further, it's by standing on the shoulder of giants, I said Newton. Yeah, I know that one. Let's go. You want me to come with you? It took both of us to open up that tunnel, didn't it? Okay. Oh yeah, thanks thanks for reminding me. Uh no. Space out, how was it? Uh, change four. Okay, here it is on the map. 
I am west of the memorial grove, north of Thorn Marsh, south of the edge of the map. <laughs> According to the map, there should be another exit further in. Just stay close. Lead the way. Okay. Mission supply box. I can't believe you actually got us in. I was dreading having to stay here any longer with those soldiers. The way they slaughtered the barbarians that approached the site. It was like they enjoyed it. Most of my people aren't like that, I promise. I'm so sorry. Let's just go back for a moment. I want to check that middle tunnel there. Over here. Wow, a little inland. Not on the beach, but close. Here is your flower, fire flower, fire gleam. Better stand back. were set on fire but hour by hour they fell and faded and the crackling trunks extinguished with a crash and all was black the brows of man by the despairing light wore an unearthly aspect of as by fists There we go.
According to the map, the exit should be this way. I'll be glad to get back above ground. Yeah, it feels like a tomb down here. A hatch at the top of the ladder. I see it. fly to him from the complex several times a day. Only the ancestors know why. Well, the ancestors are dead, Elva. Of course. How else could they be ancestors? <sighs> Looks like we have more pressing concerns. Follow my lead. Chansky's libido played a big part in this. Two things are infinite, the universe and human stupidity. Dr. Samuelson has proved that. Surely we agree she has to go. Berserk Blast. One second to feed the cat. I think I will have to fight the big flyer, even if I don't want to.
just a second. Can I make one small bomb? Can? Okay, that's enough for now. Find the entrance to the test station elm. I can't override that machine until I find where I called from. That's a big funny chicken. Vent. I think I can pull it open. Got it. I I'm right behind you.
welcome. Maybe we can get through that hatch on the ground. It looks like the one we used at the first station. There's consoles up here too! I want to get to them. You stay put. I'll see what I can find. Nothing like voting and pillaging. Another way to reach those consoles. Access point. can move these things. There we go. Huh. There's some space back there. should help. Okay, all the way out. There's another battery storage here. This one won't budge. Maybe one of the others. Aloy, would would you mind warning me next time you decide to uh, uh blow up a wall? I'll uh try. Why would you want? If you can hop on top of it, I can get you to those consoles. Exactly! Oh, this one works with manpower. If I can get this thing to Olga, I can get her to those consoles. Hold it there. Let me just... I jumped on top. Hold on. Jumping over! 
Made it! I'm at the console. Wait! There's data here. A, a lot. But it's blocked. Something's restricting access. If I can't get past it, my mission here is doomed. Alva, I'll help. If I can, okay? But first we have to get out of here. Right. We need to open the hatch. Okay, let's what? see. Okay. I'm unlocking a storage unit. There should be a power cell inside. Then you need to find a way into the generator room. Okay, I'm on it. I gotta move this. Okay, now I, I found can the move energy it. cell. There is the hole in the wall. Okay, that brought power back to the doors. You can reach me now. On my way. Okay. We need to operate both consoles simultaneously to open the hatch. I'll get to the other console. You stay here. Ready when you are. Okay, you ready? On two. One, two. That's where we need to go. Magnetic field engaged. Initiating biomass conversion process. What? No, 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 no. How do I shut this thing off? Oh, crap. Hey, Matt. What is this? Glad to see you. I think I just did something bad. That's how the world ended. Test complete. Adamantine restructural integrity uncompromised. What did we just see? Let's meet below. <laughs> Matt knows way more about this game than me. Share a file with you, okay? Test log. Um, uh, I think it's Tuesday. The second. Who cares? I'll say this for the end of the world. It's jam packed with irony. We developed biomass conversion here. Infinite food for infinite machines. And now we're racing against time to find something to give them indigestion. Well, it works. War machines won't be able to eat the reeds. But can we deploy them in time? God, I hope so. I don't understand. Your ancestors? They were wiped out. Your legacy didn't tell you that? The time of ashes. But most of the data about that is lost or forbidden. Well, they created machines that consumed all life. You just saw how. 
Matt, I'm so happy I played the first this game before playing here. this one. I need the wisdom of my ancestors to help save my people, not forbidden knowledge of their sins. I need to find something that helps, something to bring back. The overseers will punish me, or even worse, people will die. Do you understand? My family, my sister. I left her when she was 14. Already you could see her bones. They will starve. Alva. Alva. I get it. I do. Hmm. It's hard to explain, but you and I are working toward the same goal. And if I succeed, your people won't need any data. Things will just... They will get better. But even if I believe you, my people won't. I need to bring something back. Mm. Okay. Then we'll go to Test Station Ivy. And if I can find a way to kill those vines, then I will have access to the data core. What I need is in there. I'm pretty sure that if I take it, it will unblock access to all the data that this place has. And that will give you something to bring home. I'm not sure I understand. You will. But every secret makes its own maze. A diviner must persevere. That's right. That's the spirit. I'll follow. We need to keep moving. Test Station Ivy can't be far off. The Quen li sound like religious fanatics. I can't say anything else than that. I won't be surprised if there is a bishop on top pulling all the strings. that caused the time of ashes? So, I never asked. Are you from around here? No, I'm not. I spent most of my life in a place like this. Oh, we both traveled a long way then. This is it. Oh, I found a new stair. Josh, I don't think they're Germans. Okay. She doesn't Let's sound German. The proving ground. Lifted up their eyes, it grew lighter and beheld each other's aspect so and shrieked and died. Even of their mutual hideousness, they died, unknowing who he was upon whose brow. Uh, he's referring to the fact that there was forbidden knowledge, no knowledge, things like that. 
like we have the focus we've been sharing this with and the delver the supreme leader thing kind of i know what vibe he comes for Fire barrel back, I saw a fire barrel back there. So whatever we are fighting probably will be susceptible to fire. Whoa! Into battle! It's one of those machines! It can turn invisible! We're gonna have to take it out to get into the test station. Okay.
Ooh. Ow. Ouch.
Ah, miss. <laughs> that miss.
Okay. That was amazing. Uh, terrifying, but amazing. This thing was not. We should be able to get as terrible as a bullhorn. Hearing one of the metal flowers. Is that how they've been distributed? Josh, Air yeah. From these machines? Go for bullhorns. If you want a challenge, if you want something that hurts. If you want something that can one-shot you, we go for pole here. horns. There might be more machines. There has to be some data here on the adamantine wreath we can use. Oh, one thing on ultra hard, Josh. Uh, you know the small borrowers? They can one-shot you. Any machine, it can one-shot you. So Matt, am I right? Uh, are the Quen kind of religious fanatics? Next level Karjas and Walkers. Well, technically one direct hit from any of the abilities kills you. I'm talking about direct hits. Anything that's kind of a glazing hit, you're almost dead. If you could see a couple of times I got hit on the edge, so I was close to that, but most of the time if it found me in the open and had a one clean uppercut, that's that. <laughs> Interesting. Find something? The fourth test station. Willow. It looks like it's underwater. Huh. I'm gonna go look sometime. I must have faith. I walk with the ancestors. We shall find what This console's still operational. And let's see the operational console. Another log. We're done in every way. The reeds work. And cobble came through. All right, all right. Keep your secrets. <laughs> Downloading a coded key into the deployment shell triggers an enzyme that causes the reeds to eat themselves from within. But it's too late. The latest projections from U.S. Robot Command. Efforts were in vain. They ran out of time. At least we have the software module they created. It should get rid of the vines produced by the metal flowers. I need a workbench to load the module onto my spear. There's one back at our camp. The map showed a path leading back there past the next room. All right.
It is with regret that I resign. That must be the fourth testing station we saw on the map. Looks like it's been flooded for a while. Okay. In here. We'll have to climb up. Right behind you! the line to get down. Uh, right. Easy. <laughs> Made it. I still can't believe you took on all these soldiers by yourself. But we'd better make haste. After we encountered barbarians, our lieutenant called for reinforcements. Special gear. Vine cutter. Okay. Now, we get to that data core. As I was saying, I still can't believe you took on all these soldiers by yourself. But we'd better make haste. After we encountered barbarians, our lieutenant called for reinforcements. They could be here any time. Right. Oh yeah, there is the Let's hope this new module works. Flowers blooming. Let's see if the soft Silence. They're falling apart. Door's clear now. Alright. Tim, Tim, Tim. Demeter, it's time to go home. To Gaia. You see the life. Yes. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master Override activated. Restoring Demeter's subordinate function to original code. My focus glitch like that. Uh, I found a special type of data. It's something you can't read. But 
They kept a tight grip on the data core. But now you should have access to the central server. All of it. Should give you something to bring home. There, there. You were right. Hundreds of archives. Almost all of it relating to agriculture. <sighs> it would take us years to get through all of this. But we don't have that kind of time. Uh, what you said before about... <laughs> Come on. Alba, hold your fire. By the word of the ancestors, you must stop. Come, look at who you fired on. That barbarian killed our soldiers. Uh, only those who fired blindly. She is no barbarian. She gave me the data we need. Come, look at her. Can't you see? Elizabeth Sobek stands before you, an ancestor reborn. How the hell did she knows who Elizabeth Sobek is? Divina, we should bring the ancestor back. It is we who follow their word, Commander, not the other way around. Uh, my apologies, Doctor Sobek. Our people's faith is strong, but there are those who are not as familiar with the legacy as they should be. <laughs> you heard the Diviner. The data has been found. You two, with me. The rest of you, meet us back at the beach for return to landfall. Check me with the pawn. And the pawn's not even a queen. <laughs> I can't talk long. They will have many questions. So do I. Your people know a lot about the past. And about Sobek, I guess, but they're... Please, I must know. What you said before about working towards the same goal, how long will it take? I don't know. A few months? Then you are my family's best hope. Let nothing get in your way. You have opened my eyes to many things, and for that, I thank you. But now you must go. Will I see you again? Soon we return to Legacy's landfall. It might be dangerous for you to go there. Well, tell me how to reach it, just in case. We made landfall on the northeast edge of the sunken city. The currents around the archipelago are vicious, and the only approach is from the south. And it is guarded. Only attempt to go there if you must. Diviner! What's the delay? Please, go. If you attempt to stay here any longer, they may want to take you with us, and that won't go well for anyone. It's okay, Josh, no worries. There are a lot of spoilers for you here anyway. I better do as Alva says. I need to get Demeter back to Gaia anyway. But I might want to head to that tall neck I saw in the forest before I make the trek back. And that I can use the vine cutter on those other metal flowers I found earlier. Uh tall neck. Where did I see it? Tonic. Oh, there. You know what? I'd rather hit the base now and get an idea on the main story. Campfire. like you got what you wanted. Yeah. It's almost time to go after Hephaestus. Finally. We get to rock and roll. Yeah, at least uh, that's, I'll that's see and send set. you yeah, sort of a link on Steam whenever I have the chance. Uh, be right back one moment. Phone ringing.
Okay, back. And there are a lot of cauldrons I have to visit. And yes, you can throw your Discord link on my chat and I'll check it after and add you. Okay, let's see your training. Bet you're used to that focus by now. Well, I can hit machines in their weak points. I guess that's something. I wish all the other data was as easy to deal with. Now, to be honest, it's hard to understand half of what's on there. And then the other half reminds me, well, this isn't a fight you can win by just waving a hammer. Which is kind of what I do. But hey, that just means I gotta study harder. Now, make myself useful. Just give it time. Anything happen I should know about? Uh, Zoe asked us to help her bring more plants in here. Not for eating, apparently. Yeah, if you ask me, the place is fine as it is. You know, metal might be plain, but it's sturdy. Nothing wrong with that. Who needs a bunch of vegetation? I should get going. I say hi to Gaia for me. Aloy, is that what I think it is? Just need to merge it with Gaia, and she'll have enough power to handle Hephaestus. Good news. So, what can I do for you? How's your training well, if Zoe's going? not upset, I'm distracting you from your training. Yeah, I don't think you have to worry about that. What do you mean? What happened? Well, before Zoe found a way to fix the land gods, I suggested that when Gaia was fully restored, she could just make new ones. Well, once we get a Festus, that's definitely a possibility. That's what I said. But I guess there was something about my tone she didn't like. She got pretty raw. Said I didn't understand the way her tribe feels about those machines. Which is true, of course. And the last thing I'd ever want to do is dismiss their traditions. <laughs> but I was trying to look at things differently. More like you, you know? To see a machine as... Just a machine. Yeah, I guess I led you into trouble there, didn't I? Not your fault. Don't worry. A machine is Did just you a machine. Talk to Zoe after your fight? I suffered through a few hours of glaring silence. Then she seemed to move on. Sort of. How do people do this? How do I know if the next thing I say won't blow up in my face? You don't. What if an apology is not enough next time? You give her a stuffed animal? You're the worst. You know that? What makes you think I know anything <laughs> about any of this? You're on your own. Abandoning me again, huh? Well, if she kills me next time, it's on you. Better get this to Gaia. You did it, Aloy. Let's Good luck, Josh. On the ale. Have Let's fun on your me. journey. I'll let Aaron know. Don't die to machines. Okay. Aloy, you've returned. And you come bearing gifts. Does this mean we'll soon be able to uproot the zeniths from our lands? That's what I'm hoping. Good. You ever play that board game Aaron set up? Strike? I'm the one who gave it to him. I was hoping it'd distract him enough to spare us that ruckus he calls death metal. No such luck. <laughs> it looked like you were working on something over there. With Gaia now growing in strength, I've been trying to find a way to heal the land gods. Even if some people think I should give up on them. I Already wonder if some sorry. of the classics Your on Metal made might it. Be a good idea to replace the land gods with new machines when Gaia recovers. It wasn't. The land gods have taken care of our people for generations. They are not some broken toy to be thrown away. Even if they are just machines doing their job, to abandon them in their time of suffering seems cruel. I'm sure Varl understands that too. He does now. I had to get pretty mad at him at first, though. You know I can hear you guys, right? Like, what kind of death metal is he listening to? Arc enemy? Maybe from, maybe something worse or better. 
Did they have a record of Led Zeppelin? I should get going. If you need me, you know Really wondering if there was a list of what metal music made it into the Horizon universe. You look like you've got something to say. Just a couple of questions. Looks like things between you and Zoe are better now. I suffered through a few hours of glaring silence. Then how do people do this? What if an apology is not enough next time? You give her a stuffed animal? You're the worst. What makes you... Abandoning me again, huh? Okay. I should go hand this okay. over to Gaia. I already had that By conversation. What's my favorite one-handed man doing? You busy? Kotawo. One must never be idle when at war. But there is always time to speak to one's commander. Oh, that's... that's not really how I see myself. It is how we see you. Anything interesting happened while I was away? I found an acceptable place to practice with my blade. Oh, and where is that? Outside, above the base. There's a nest of sun wings that are always up for a fight. Ever thought of sparring with something that's not trying to kill you? That would defeat the purpose of the training. <laughs> and you were asking why do I play on ultra hard? That would defeat the purpose of having fun. What have you been up to? Varl has asked to learn the differences between my people's clans. So I've been teaching him to knock the history. It is heavy with blood and death, but also with honorable deeds and vanquished tyrants. Maybe you'd like to hear about it as well, when our mission is done. I'd be honored. I'll let you get back to your training. And so will I. Beta. Okay, nothing to talk to with Beta. It is good to see you again, Aloy. I see you have recovered Demeter. With the acquisition of Aether, Poseidon, and Demeter, my heuristic processing density has expanded greatly. I should now be able to absorb Hephaestus, and fortunately, we have made progress on a plan to capture it. With Varl's encouragement, Beta analyzed all available information on Hephaestus. Its expansion has been rampant. It is too large to be beam cast, and the kernel you've been using could never hold it. Therefore, it must be contained in a location with a direct physical connection to me. A place with two data cores. Two cores? Where would we find a place like that? Gemini. An abandoned cauldron in the desert west of here. Seismic activity disrupted the original construction. Two data cores were built as a result. I've been there. The Tanakh marked the entrance as some kind of ritual ground. We'll have to bring you there by hand. I have devised a blueprint for a suitable, albeit unwieldy, transport rig. It will require two people to carry it to Gemini. I can help. Once I am installed on the first core, 
I will call down Hephaestus on the other, trapping it. I will then initiate the merge. However, in order to construct the rig, I will need considerable help. Can you build it? I suppose I could, but it's not gonna work. The Zeniths will find you. Minerva won't be able to conceal your location. That is correct. Absorbing Hephaestus will create a significant power surge, easily detected by anyone capable of noticing. But what if there were multiple power surges? To fake out the Zeniths? If Erend, Zoe, and Catalo spread out to the other cauldrons and create their own surges, would those conceal the one at Gemini? Analyzing. Such a tactic might be effective. With Beta's help, we should be able to build a set of handheld pulse generators. I told you it's not gonna work! I did a test. Hephaestus has written Alpha Clearance out of its access module. You'll never be able to capture it! Then we need a higher level of clearance. There is no higher- Ted Pharaoh's Mega Clearance. The one he used to purge the Apollo database and kill the Alphas. But to get it, you would have to find Thebes. The private bunker he retreated to when the world ended, and nobody knows where that is, not even the Zeniths. Their only intel was that it was somewhere in San Francisco. That might be all I need. Alva, the Quen Diviner I met, said her people had set up a base at Landfall. They were searching for data in San Francisco from there. She might be able to help. So I guess I'm headed all the way west. While I'm gone, will you be able to build the rig and the pulse generators? I'll try. I'll make sure she has what she needs. Alva said the Quen have a ferry on the coast that they used to get to the ruins of San Francisco. That's where I need to go. Hey, Gaia. I'm back. So I see. Halo in your mind. I have managed to unlock an additional room near the servers. Understood. Have you been able to make use of Demeter's functions? Yes. I was able to mitigate most soil conditions and restore a temporary balance. You should notice less rampant plant growth in the area. Maybe that'll give Plainsong's fields a chance to recover. Unfortunately, recovery in that area is unlikely without the assistance of the Utaru's land gods. I have discussed this matter with Zoe. I believe we may have a workaround. Yeah, I'm helping her out with that. There's something I'm still trying to figure out. Why was Demeter using flying machines to distribute metal flowers? In its deranged state, Demeter was defending itself against a robotic swarm that would devour all plant life. It thought the Pharaoh Plague was still happening? It feared it would come again. As part of its directive of receding Earth's vegetation, it sought to protect plant life at all costs. And considering it had 20 years to proliferate, I expect you will continue to find the fruits of its efforts for some time. That's a good thing I have the code to dissolve the vines, then. Yeah, the code to dissolve the vines. Hack the metal flower. Beta's convinced we won't be able to capture Hephaestus. With that attitude, do you really think she'll be able to build the rig and pulse generators? It may take some coaxing, but with some assistance, I am confident she will. I don't get her, Gaia. She's so quick to assume we'll fail. She's nothing like... like what I thought she'd be. I guess it'll be best if she stays here when we go to Gemini. All this data I've picked up in ancient bunkers and ruins... I guess I never really thought that other people would be looking at it. Based on my observations, your companions engage quite frequently with this material. Erend has asked on numerous occasions about birthday parties. <laughs> he appears perplexed by the tradition of serving a sweet confection. 
as it conflicts with the Asaram tradition of serving sparkling stout ale. He also suggested we host a party for you, as a surprise. Uh, yeah, no thanks. That is what I predicted. <laughs> is Catalo getting along with everyone? Yes, though he prefers to spend most of the time alone. He appears to be collating data on war machine progression and significant battles during the Pharaoh Plague. To aid in the creation of a war map of Operation Enduring Victory. I believe he aims to study the tactics of old world warfare. I'd be interested in seeing that. It appears to be a private pastime for him. He has repeatedly declined my offers to assist his research. So our plan to capture Festus. Let's go over it again. As you wish. Thanks to Beta's test, we now know that Hephaestus will not respond to your Alpha Clearance. Which is why you will need to procure Ted Farrow's Omega Clearance. Right. From his personal bunker, Thebes. While you are gone, I will assist Beta in building the transport rig and pulse generators. When we get to Gemini, I will need to be installed on one of the facility's cores. The second core is for Hephaestus. Using Omega Clearance will allow you to trap it. And then you'll be able to absorb it? Not quite. You will need to manually remove Hephaestus's malicious code before the merge. How long will that take? There are calculations I still must run, but I estimate a few hours. And during that time, the others will create a distraction for us using the pulse generators, right? Correct. They will each take position at a cauldron door and fire off their device. The energy surge should mask our activities until the merge is complete. And then we'll have everything we need to defeat the Zenus. Sounds like a plan. So now that you have Aether, Demeter, and Poseidon, how's the biosphere looking? In the local region, conditions have improved. Superstorms have subsided. Water sources have been purified. And soil conditions remediated. These improvements will stave off environmental collapse for a few additional months. Well, with luck, soon you'll have Hephaestus. Then you'll be able to fix the biosphere for good, right? Correct. I will be able to design and produce robotic agents to permanently reverse the environmental damage that has accumulated. There's something I've been wondering. How could Ted Farrow create a clearance level higher than Alpha? Elizabeth made sure he wouldn't interfere with the project. It is plausible he tasked his own engineers with creating a backdoor to the Zero Dawn system. Without You're making me hungry. Knowledge. My predecessor <laughs> did not even know of its existence so until he activated it to purge is it the database. It the is food? in effect a blind spot. One that will allow us to subdue Hephaestus. And fortunately, thanks to Beta's information, we know where Omega Clearance may be procured. Right. Somewhere in San Francisco. So the facility where I recovered Demeter used to be a Faro Agricultural Research Facility. It's where they created the biomass conversion system, but also adamantine wreath. Did Elizabeth know they were working on that? It is likely she was briefed on other efforts to combat the machine swarm. Though her focus was devoted only to Zero Dawn. That makes sense. But they actually got the wreaths to work. If they've been able to deploy it against the Pharaoh Plague in time... Using the data you recovered on the project, I ran several simulations and have concluded that it would never have worked. 
Damn, I wasted. The Pharaoh war machines would eventually hack and deactivate the wreaths before they could contain the swarm. So Zero Dawn really was the only solution. There was a lot of data in the greenhouse facility about agriculture. Do you think it'll help the Quen fix their homeland? I will run a query. Complete. The data contains information about novel crop production methods, which may be beneficial to the tribe in the long term. But new crops aren't going to save the world, so I guess it's on us. It is. So, in your spare time, you take catering jobs? So, Gemini has two data cores. I've never seen a cauldron like that. But you mentioned something about seismic activity? When my predecessor attempted to build the cauldron, construction was disrupted by a series of earthquakes. The data core had already been built. But the rest of the facility sustained damage. So, she began again. A second core was built. However, when more tremblers occurred, she abandoned the site. Lucky for us. Are the quakes still happening? No. Though they did also create instabilities in other facilities in the region. By the way, with the new job, I have found out something that makes me feel uncomfortable. It's a small thing, but it's new to me. Uh, turns out on an official government position, nobody likes people doing things without having permission to do, even if it is the right thing to do. I mean, what, I, what I've understood so far is that you can prepare something to be ready at the button and just do it at the say do it but you don't do it until there is an order to do so <laughs> even if it's the right thing to do I guess makes me feel going. weird as you say like i did my job and now i'm waiting for someone to say you can do it Not talking about myself directly, I have no special tasks that I'm doing right now, except being educated how to. But this one was like top top thing to let me know to handle. Everything there is to know about everything. Let's just say here about you going west. Turns out we need one last thing before we can grab Hephaestus. Because it would have been too easy otherwise. You've been looking at any interesting data? Yeah, I asked Gaia to find me something to look at a while back. And she found the mother of all forges. They called it sports. Turns out the <laughs> old ones spent a lot of time tackling and punching each other for points in, in one game or another. Are you mixing some solid food and fresh ale? I bet half the claim will be lining up to watch. And he found boxing. How are things with Catalo? He's still scared of him. Oh, she thinks she's funny. Actually, I played strike with him. I had to fill in most of the conversation myself, but well, I'm still alive. Glad to hear it. I guess we'll find out when the the first I need to get one going. year passes I by. I the answer, but are you sure you don't need any help? Gaia mentioned this uh, other tribe you found, the Quen. They sound like a nasty but bunch. I'm not complaining or anything. I'm just saying I find it strange. In the meantime, Varl will help you get ready for but what comes next. I come from a place where if you could do something, you should do something. You didn't have to wait for being allowed to. I'm sorry, Aloy. After all the trouble you went through, you have to head west again. Well, no one said this was going to be easy. You sure you don't want any backup dealing with the Quen? They think I'm Sobek or something like that. 
They won't hurt me, but I doubt they'll be so kind to anyone else. If you say so, let me know if you need anything before you go. If I get Omega clearance and then we grab Hephaestus, we might finally have the advantage over the Zeniths. Can't wait to see their faces as they stare down a bunch of charging thunder jaws. Better them than us, <laughs> for once. You better not be slacking off on your studies while I'm gone. And risk Zoe coming after me? I value my life. In fact, <laughs> I've been reading about Ted Farrow, how he destroyed the world and crawled into a hole after killing those who saved it. He definitely was a piece of work. Da -da 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 -da. Ah, not even forgiveness. Here the thing is more of a... You have a procedure, you do the procedure, everything's ready and you're right to do it per the procedure. But you have to wait for a final go. That's not written anywhere, but you have to wait for it before you complete the procedure. Let's explain it like that. It's, it's just strange and new. It's strange because it's new. <laughs> and I think, I think it will be fine. Well, Beta and Gaia built the rig. Can you get everyone ready for the mission ahead? I found my f new favorite quote today in this game it's just that by Albert Einstein. We'll get Gaia and she'll help us set things right. No more zeniths, no more derangement. It'll be a different world. I welcome it, but... And it fits perfectly with be. any situation I'm in right now. Everyone. Let's just focus on fixing Gaia for now. You're right. We've got an angry AI to take down. If we knew what it was we were doing, it would not be called research, would it? Albert Einstein. I'll be in touch if I need anything. I'll make sure Beta briefs everyone on the pulse generator. The perfect quote for starting a new job. Even if it's the same thing you've done. Aloy, I hear you're going further west, past the Tanakhth clan lands. Do you know anything about the area? Only hearsay. The Utaru tell stories of an island that lies beyond the western coast. They call it the Isle of Spires. It is said the Old Ones built towers there that touched the sky, so they could live far away from the earth that bore them. As if they didn't want to be reminded that they'd one day return to it. Sounds like something Ted Farrow would do. How much have you read on Ted Farrow? Enough to wonder how a man who worked so hard to heal the world once could let greed and pride condemn it so easily. For one spirit to diminish in such a way, I, I'm not sure if I should hate him or pity him. You and Varl doing okay? Uh, uh training. I mean, we're doing fine, although I admit it'd be nice to take a small break from studying, just the two of us. But then who'd look after Erend? Well, there's always Katalo. Leave allowed Osaram with a brooding Tanakh. What could go wrong? What's everyone been up to? I've been trying to share some of my meals with Beta. Thought it might help her feel more at home. Maybe even get her to sleep up here instead of in that dark basement. She would not be moved. I appreciate you trying. Patience reaps the best harvest. I'm not giving up hope yet. Okay, we'll go oh, kill we the land gods. Hopefully I can bring back after that. I'm gonna need everyone. We'll be ready. Let's see if the other guys have anything new to say. You have a quest now, haven't you? Got a minute? As many as you need. I have to travel beyond the western coast. To the ruins, mm -hmm. shrouded in fog. Yes. Am I far I'm from the point where I learned plan. how to fly? I encountered them once before. They said they came from across the great ocean. I was hoping the Tanakh knew more about them. Hmm. There were 
rumors of trespassers in the area, but we thought they were just bandits. Hikaru sent out a patrol or two, but I don't recall them reporting back. We've had more pressing concerns, as you know. I'm sorry. That's all I can tell you. Oh, it's okay. I guess I'll find out soon enough. There is oh, vacations are important for the mental health. You. It's personal. Ask the Zenits in beta. You have a moment they spare. know what a mental health day off would is. <laughs> What do Tanakh do to so relax? So I can you know, to take a break from training. We play strike. I can do those You're two missions, get Aaron. flying, it's and there will not be a Although point of no return be. in it those missions, right? Not losing Both quests, etc. Somehow that still sounds like training. This is why I'm stepping carefully when playing the game because. For the first game, I knew that you can't fail a side quest. But I don't know if you can fail a side quest or Found miss a side quest during, your training? during told me where to find the game. How wars were waged in the old world. I knew the ten fought against machines, much as we do now. But it seems they were among the last of their kind. Later, machines battled other machines on behalf of greedy leaders as they provide for lands and spoils. At least the Tanakh have the courage to put their lives on the line when conflicts arise. Okay, so I can just push for those Maybe two main missions, get it and return to do yes. all the side missions after. Hikaru, With so unlocked well. flying and quickly travel traveling around. You said there was something you wanted to talk about? I've been speaking with Gaia. She mentioned that the Zeniths bind metal with flesh to make themselves stronger. I was wondering if you'd help me do the same. You want to make yourself a new arm? Yes. Gaia insists she can help me build such a thing if I can get the necessary data and materials. She believes these things lie in the place where Beta hid from the Zeniths. Their ancient research lab. I am not as familiar with old world machinery as you are. I could use your assistance. It might be dangerous. The Zenus probably still keep an eye on that place. We were lucky to get out of there alive the first time. I see. Okay, so like worth the risk. getting flying Damn, doesn't throw me into the point of no return. I can just rush, get flying, come back, and do the side quests. And when I've done all the side call. quests and cold runs to my heart's I'll desire, we'll I can go finish the main course. story and head Thank into the Burning Shores. On my trusty Quetzalcoatl. Okay, can talk with you again. Then let's make a rush. And dirt. Don't forget all that dirt. I don't have anything here. Okay, does it break quests? Will I lose quests, side activities, etc. That I better do now before I do the that major event before flying. Something else you wanted to do? Any progress with your plan for the land gods? Is the reboot code ready? It is. But there is difficult work ahead. Gaia warned me that because the land gods are linked together in a network, the code must be delivered to all of them. 
Most are in plain song, but in recent years, three of them wandered off. So, T, and Do. We have to find them? No. We know where they are, but they're hard to reach. So, wandered into a lake and sank. Do ventured into a dangerous canyon, and T broke down amidst a herd of machines. Okay. Tell you what. You go to Plainsong, handle all the land gods there. I'll take care of So, T, and Do. I'll need their locations, plus the reboot code. I'm sending the data to you now. My people made shrines near where each land god faltered. When you see them, you'll know you're close. And once again, thanks it will for break you. something else. I'm not gonna let your people starve, so I promise. I'll let you know when I've delivered the reboot code to So T and Do. Good. When you're underway, I'll do the same for the land gods at Plainsong. Now you're making me nervous, like... Okay, it won't break any story component. That's that, right? I can go grab flying, not breaking any component on the story. Year beta. Way out, way out, way out. There is a way out here. There is a way out here. It's gonna be harder to see in the snow. Aloy, it's a long way to the coast. If you need to resupply en route, I suggest stopping in Falls Edge. It's a lowland clan village southwest of the grove, in the heart of the jungle. Got it. Thanks for the advice. Okay, follow that. Here we come. May your blade be bright. Seek for honor. Good day, Outlander. Did the enemy give you any this trouble must be out there? Falls Edge. Tell us that I could resupply here and head for the Quan Fair. Must be precise. You. Outlander. Come and trade. Hundred forty one impact, hundred twenty five tier.
Okay, tools, resources. Okay, I have got goat. That look, it's time to change it, right? Let's see what can I upgrade easily. Pelican feather. Potion master, do you have a pelican feather? Okay, that falls edge behind me. I'll head west until I reach the coast and the Quen Ferry. When danger's on the way, you need supplies. Dick Feather. Okay. <laughs> Hunting is not always the way. But I love this thing about the second game. You can go buy upgrades from different vendors. Moonfish skin, three of them. No, I don't think I have. I haven't been to the ocean. I saw the coastline through one mission. Met an unfriendly treasure there. Save the prison. The right remedy can save a life in the water. Sure. It's not like you need a boost, I'm ready to trade. Okay, there was Vulture Feather and Raccoon Height. Vulture Feather, two more. Let's increase my upgrade site. When dangers on the way, remember to use them. <laughs> Are they great white sharks?
Okay, I think that's enough for upgrades for now. Now, let's craft some ammo. Okay. No thanks. No sharks, no sharks. Okay. May your blade be bright. <laughs> And with the song in mind and the GPS in hand, let's go to the campfire. A new town. Your enemy is one. May our blade strike as one. May your blade be sharp. Oh. a spear into the heart of this rebellion. Good day. Over there. No campfire over there. Alrighty. Outlander, will you trade with the Tanakh? 
For a person who knows nothing about San Francisco except the song, I think it will be curious for me. What was it? If you're going to San Francisco, make sure to bring some flowers in your hand. Elite rope caster. Elite rope caster, it is. Anchor rope caster. And Overizing spark thrower it is over Okay and there I am broke again and your battle is half long Okay, I have spikes. Yeah, I know Golden Gate Bridge. I know it as pictures. Is she sick? It's Aloy, isn't it? I just... If you ask me on the top of my head, I wouldn't be able to immediately make a difference between that bridge and the one that's at Manhattan. Connecting Manhattan to New York. I mean, it's not on the top of my head. For months, it I know the Niagara Falls immediately. I know the State of Liberty immediately. To live with it as best we can. But recently, and Yellowstone Park has some distinctive much of the land, land surface. One river still runs red, like a split vein from a rotted corpse. So the water here is still poisoned? Exactly. I sent my best squad to find its source, led by Zala's mother. They failed to report back. Akaro told me how you dropped part of the throne on Magala at the Cool Root. Saved his life. So lend me your strength. Together we can find my squad and the source. I just saw Golden Gate Bridge. Sounds like you know Hikaru pretty well. He was my commander before he was my chief. I had served in his squad since we were bare-armed youths. Back then, he was a merciless warlord. Determined to destroy any enemy of the Lowland clan. I'm just picking this quest up. I'm going for the main story after. I want flying. He guard outside as he claimed the throne within. He entered a conqueror. But returned with the ambition of ending the constant bloodshed between the clans because he saw Faraday's message yes that vision changed him gave him new purpose he became our first chief ruler of all Tanakh and dedicated the tribe to fighting machines instead of each other 
I've been talking with a friend some couple of months ago that in USA you have so much landmass and so many um, sites to see that as he said he can understand why a lot of Americans have never left the country if you don't dedicate to just traveling and sightseeing you you might not even have a lifetime to visit all the places that are possible in USA alone. And you have to dedicate to that, to do it. And to go to other countries as well. If you're so close with Hikaru, why aren't you a marshal? I wanted to serve as one, but Hikaru needed someone he could trust to lead his former clan. Maintaining control of the desert and sky clans is difficult enough for him. But the title wasn't handed to me. I fought for the honor, as our rights demand. Five days of scars and blood. By the last sunset, I stood alone. The new commander. Close to 20 years have passed since. This blood choke. Is that what you call the red algae? Yes. A couple years ago, it was only a thin streak of red in the river. It grew over time until it was a constant poison. It sickens those who drink the polluted water, kill the fish we used to catch. But a while ago, unexplainably, the rivers began to clear, all except for one. Because of it, my people continue to waste away, weakening the clan. I'll help you find your missing squad. Good. I'm heading out now. The longer the blood choke remains, the longer my people suffer. We'll follow the Red River. The squad would have done the same. Might be able to pick up some sign of them. You ready? I'll catch up. Actually, I have some things to do first. I'll meet up with you. Very well. Look for the mouth of the Red River. Follow it, and you'll find me wherever it leads. Okay. I'll be there when I can. Upstream, I should find a Tekka and the source of the poison. Well, chargers are very good for an even terrain.
Come on, move. from taking a boat. What the? No one's stopping me from taking a boat and suddenly a wild thing appears. Pretty much what it is around today, it will be very warm here as well. We expect 33 35 degrees by Wednesday, and then we expect a very, very severe temperature drop from 35 to about 13. All right, almost there. It's pushing me south. There's no choice but to head for that beach. There, there. There was Alva, there is no Alva. Where are the Quinn? They're a landfall, I guess. I better go find it. Should be to the northeast. You know, it will be fine. Soon someone will figure out how to make machines with AI to dive in the oceans, clear the skies. Then we'll hear someone had created entirely manual, entirely automated machines to fight for us. I don't see what could go wrong, do you? The earth is flat? No, no it isn't. Dear piggy piggy.
As I said, nothing can go wrong, right? I'm certain the US have heard about Horizon Zero Dawn and how the world the world supposedly ended in a computer game. San Francisco. Suddenly I feel small. So over here. That would be interesting. Another Cyclops drone. Gotta grab its data to re. Connect with the dome back at the base. Oops. 
Maybe I can climb something to jump onto the drone. Okay. That will be interesting. No! There is nowhere going higher, is it? No. I hate this quieter. I so hate this quieter. You know...
I'm never getting pissed about fighting a monster. I mean, it's annoying to lose over and over and having to adapt your strategy, but there is sort of a strategy. But this type of mini games, they piss me off. <laughs> No, higher? I don't know. Stuck? Maybe I can. Nope, can't throw myself out with the bomb.
who doesn't? I mean, that's the whole point for buying a game. Look for a way to get stuck into the geometry. I'm not here for the drone just knowing that it's trying to avoid me saying must be the entrance to landfall about I'll be right back for a moment. Is that her? The living ancestor. This is Landfall, right? I'm looking for Alba. Overseer Bohai ordered us to invite you before him should you approach. Please, come with me. Go. Let Overseer Bovine? Man, that's that sounds big. It's her! The diviner was right. Overseer Bohai, a stranger just walked through the gate. I knew Alva would not dare lie. You do look like Sobek. Is Alva here? I need to talk to her. I will consider your request once it is determined what you are. A living ancestor as Alva believes, or a threat lurking in such a guise. I am no threat, okay? Back on the mainland, your soldiers fired on me without warning. So you say, infidel. None of those you engaged survived to bear witness. I held off on your squad when... Overseer Bovine. He looks bovine. May I present our honored CEO? CEO? So, here she is. Our great mystery. Well, Bohai, what have you divined? What is Oh, she's not Bovine, he's Bohai. <laughs> A mystery indeed, my CEO. How can she appear as Sobek, and yet know nothing of our ways? 
Are we to believe that a living ancestor was born to this wretched land? An ocean apart from the realm of the Chosen? And if so, to what end? I cannot answer. Only she can. But I warn you, no falsehood will satisfy us. Now speak. Why are you here? What is your purpose? I'm looking for a place called Thebes. And what do you seek there? Alva told me a little bit about what you're after. I guess you could say I want what you want. A way to heal the world. As I suspected. Tell her. We found Thebes. The final resting place of Ted Pharaoh's secrets. It isn't far. But the way is closed to us. Machine attacks have cut us off from the site. Diviner Alva is there, along with a complement of diggers and soldiers. Is she all right? Our scouts tell us that a machine has our people pinned behind their defenses, but they're holding out. Machines, huh? I can help with that. Alva told us that you are indeed formidable. But I have a few questions first. We will answer what we can. Is this a job interview? So you found Thebes. How? The ancestors revealed it to us not long after we made landfall. Almost a year ago. Through a scrap of ancient data discovered by Alva and verified by myself. It contained details about the construction of a great underground palace. Where, exactly? Close. Beneath the Great Pyramid in the ruins beyond. Figures. Ted loves his pyramids. Have you been inside? Uh, no. That has been a problem, one of many. And we will solve them all in time. Getting back to the site is the one at hand. I hope you're as effective against machines as Diviner Alva suggested. What exactly are you looking for inside Thebes? I thought Alva brought back the data you needed. We risked much to cross the ocean. Therefore, we must unearth every possible link to the legacy while we are here. Especially one as important as Thebes. We will not sail back until I have plundered its secrets. So, Alva reports to you. I was chosen by my colleagues on the Board of Overseers to supervise data retrieval on this expedition, yes. And you're in charge of the expedition. He is far more than that. You are addressing the cousin of the Emperor of the Quinn. Why Heir does to this guy give me a, the great Delta, an the Asian vibe? In five generations. The quotes, the dressing. All she needs to understand is that I am the authority here. And my will is to attain the secrets of Thebes.
Mine too. We're in luck. You crossed the ocean on these ships? Couldn't have been easy. Greatness is never easy. Indeed. It took seven years just to build the flotilla. This expedition is the most important undertaking of our generation. A quest for knowledge across the gaping sea with nothing less than the fate of our tribe at stake. And none of it would have been possible without the will of the CEO. The voyage was difficult. The wilds here even more so. Our sailors and soldiers have suffered much. I know that. But all for the glory of the Quen. Good to know. Okay, let's go what with that machine. What kind of machine has your people pinned down near Thebes? A thunder jaw. We've dealt with them before, but this one is... Tougher, stronger, and it has black armor? Yes. How did you know? Oh my. <sighs> Doesn't matter. Won't be easy, but I can take it down. Then destiny shines upon us, as I and she will help me attain the secrets of Thebes. Um, the chief, the man bun. I don't like this then guy. Then on Thebes that we will follow when our scouts confirm you've cleared the way. Hmm. The sea, yo. Bracing, I guess. Scouts found ancient ruins west of here. They claim to have seen a relic of the ancestors inside, but couldn't find a way to retrieve it. Perhaps a living ancestor could discover a way where others could not. Maybe if I find myself in the area. All right. Let's see. Outfits. Oh, I'm broke. Vader, Grave Singer. Sell resources. A little less broke now. They built a catamaran. I've traveled on boat like this. Very stable. It's quite fast. Not like a yacht, but good enough.
wish us to succeed in our mission here. Then I had better not hear of any more doubts. Follow your orders. The legacy teaches us nature. Okay. Off to the big pyramid to fight the Thunderjaw. Okay. Let's go have item already owned. Alright. If I own the item I can't buy it to sell for profit. So unfair. Barbarian! Run, stranger! The There's machine a killer will machine kill you. about! There you are. I guess we're doing this. They are not going to help, are they?
Yeah, good to know, good to know.
<laughs> I yeah, I wasn't healing because I had wasted all my herbs at the start. There you are. I guess we're doing this. It is a tough fight, I agree. There you are. I guess we're doing this. I don't have acid. Perfect. Chain reaction fire. I have fire, okay. There is one usable weapon. They throw some fiery arrows at him. I guess we're doing this. And that's that. 
And let me change to one of my favorite spears. I think it was this one. Let's see if I'm right. Drill spike. Yeah. I kinda prefer the drill spike here. On. I mean is very We're doing this. If I get to see your face, it would be easy.
something's messing with my focus. Most of the time, the camera stands in my way. I couldn't turn around this time. <laughs>
where you are. I guess we're doing this.
Start searching! Keep your eyes open! So there it is, what a hunter-gatherer can accomplish with some spikes. Drill, drill, drill my way inside under jaws. Merrily, 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 merrily. Come on over, you. You killed that machine. Your CEO sent me. I need to speak to Alva. By all means, then. Open the gates. Alva, I'm glad you're okay. Oh, you got rid of that machine. But what are you doing here? There's something inside. Why do I have the feeling that Alva is drugged? I oh, you got rid that of that machine. Yay! CEO. <laughs> we came to an agreement. Kind of. And you're going to help us get in? I guess so. I can Hopefully most definitely say that the tense. spear is my best aim so far. That guy. And I don't understand what he wants from Thebes. I thought we found the data that your people needed back on the mainland. That data will take us years to sift through. The CEO wants faster results. Aloy, you have to be careful. He's... There they are. The legacy tells us that Elizabeth Sobek helped the ancestors cast aside all obstacles. And so it has been today. You have been true to your word. I'm pleased. Thebes awaits us below, shall we? Quite an excavation. Much of this was flooded. We had to pump a great deal of water out. Behold, the door to Thebes. A door like no other. Tudor Faro. Well, you're right about that. It's designed to open for only one man. Ted Faro. But the legacy tells us that he worked closely with Sobek. He trusted her. Eh. Surely she could open the door, and so surely can you. Not gonna happen. At least not from this side. You said she was a living ancestor with Sobek's eternal essence. Uh, if I may... Pharaoh, great as he was, did not build his palace alone. We know this from scraps of data we found. The ones that pointed to this location. And we found evidence of passages below. Maybe they were built to aid construction. Or for servants. We can't reach them. The way is flooded and they're too far underwater, but... I... Yeah, I can reach them. There might be another way in down there. You see? With Sobek, there is always a way. Then do what you must to get us inside. Charming. What was his name again? CEO? Oh, 
waters in the morning. Here's the hot Geothermal energy. Uh, as you said, there is time for some war. There is no fighting here. I can swim calmly, right? I don't have to be stressed that something will pop out of nowhere and try to eat me. There is this thing, uh, the underwater puzzles with monsters or something I didn't like from the start. Stop the turbine. Good. Jim, writing to stay sane in this crazy place. I can't believe Grigori's dead. Our so-called spiritual leader was fine yesterday, and then suddenly passed away in his sleep, and no one will talk to me about it. They treat me like a child, whispering behind my back, as if I can't cope with death, even after the end of the world. So Ted had other people in here with him. Including a teenage girl. It looks like an exercise room. My favorite bar. So 
Matt, this is my favorite bar. The small bars, the big bars. There's some pack deckers. Big too. There's nothing normal about a scientist, his daughter, a guru, and well, let's face it, a harem living through the end times in the trillionaire's underground survival bunker. But now that Kagori's gone, I'm worried things will get even weirder. He helped keep Ted stable for a couple of years, sort of. Without him, who knows? And we don't even understand what happened to him. The girl's right. Nothing normal about Ted. And living quarters. Living in a bunker for the end of your days and being a teenager. Looks like they've had sleeping quarters wherever they wanted. And something like Coca Cola. This is the way to the main door, so I can let the Quinn in. Okay. This is back to the living quarters. Okay. This way. Look at this place. It's pretty fancy for a survival bunker. Most of Ted's women repulse me, okay? 
There were contestants on a housewife sim preening for the hubby's attention. But Brianna, yeah. the door, the hollow singer, Let's she's different. Inside. She's always been nice to me, and I love her it's voice, like kind of which has been control. conspicuously silent since Grigori died. She doesn't speculate or gossip like the others. She knows something. I can tell. And I'm gonna find out what it is. Okay. I feel sad about this little girl. But that far sounds disturb disturbingly normal here on this recording. Like someone you don't expect to do something as stupid as he did. What about the main door? Okay, let's check this out. This loot looks like a half of what statues have busted. Could be wrong, of course. The Eye of Ra. Ah, good. An emergency exit function. The door is open. Destiny is upon us. I knew you could do it. What's going on? The CO is preparing to enter Thebes. The CEO. Oh, why are you dressed like Ted Pharaoh? I am Pharaoh, renewed. My essence is the same as his. Across the years, across the generations, his soul is my soul. His will is my will. We are sundered in only one way. I need his final testament, his deepest secrets. And now that the door is open, those secrets are within my grasp. When I have them, kill him. I will kill him be before he lays. Complete as he was. I will have everything I need to save our homeland, and as Pharaoh did, the world. Someone tell him the truth? Destroy all his hopes? Okay. I think there's some confusion here about who Pharaoh really was. No one knows better than I who he was, who he is. Me. The Renewer, greatest of the ancestors, the man who saved the world. And you. You understand, Sobek. You are her, Pharaoh's harbinger, his assistant. <laughs> Come. Really? We will descend into Thebes together, as it should be. Bring her the raiment. I can finish this raiment? right here, right now. As he is Pharaoh, you are Sobek. For an occasion, this momentous shouldn't you wear Give me the bow, the arrow. Everybody look away for a moment. No, 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 no. No, I am not wearing that. No way. You will wear the proper attire to mark this moment. Or what? It is said Sobek valued life above all else. Is this true?
fine. I'll wear your raiment. <laughs> At least nobody said you look nice. <laughs> Outfits. So becrayment. Assistant to Ted Farr. <laughs> it's fine. Somewhere in here, Pharaoh left his. Looks like the emergency exit function unlocks this door too. Indeed. Let it be done. Pharaoh's visage, a monument to greatness. Truly, my seal. It's a monument to something, I'll give you that. Great risks bring great bounties, Overseer. He built with vision. I think this way might lead down. Excellent. Remember every detail of his, Bohai, for posterity. It will be its own chapter in your legacy. Oh. Brianna told me that Gregory hacked into restricted files and found out something awful. That Ted murdered important people who worked on Why Zero Dawn. Did Ted for himself. punish Gregory? Kill him? For discovering what he did? How could that be? Dad said there wasn't a mark on Krikori's body. His heart just gave out. Find anything interesting? I am... Um, I can't make sense of it yet. Wonder if Pharaoh had a foot bath. <laughs> I've always wanted to. There will be no further discussion of your feet. So hey, this is weird. Yeah, I tried to warn you. Yeah, sort of. I'll explain everything if we survive long enough. Those no. certainly look threatening. Huh. Statues. The guardians of Pharaoh's domain. No. Please, no. Those aren't statues. Look out! Get the CO out of here! This is just us, then.
Oh, come on! <laughs> you said wartime. It's on you. You didn't say wartime. Thanks. Where's Overseer Bohai? He has decided to return to the surface. A wise choice. We can't afford to lose any more diviners than necessary. So, no more delays. We must proceed. Brianna didn't wake up this morning. She's gone. Just like Grigori. Is that all? Most of Ted's women repulse me, okay? Brianna didn't wake up this morning. She's gone. Just like Grigori. I'm looking up at the giant, hideous statue of Ted in the Great Hall. At his eyes. And I know now that he's watching me. He's watching us all. He's always had power over us. Don't know if I will ever be able to visit this place again, so loot as much as I can. Yes, that looks like the way. When I built this place, when its special systems were designed, I knew what I wanted. Protection, of course. 
an unlimited power source, that was a given. But also... Control. Over every possible eventuality. After all, you never know what'll happen, especially when the human element is involved. What did you find? Trust me. You don't want to know. I guess I don't. Ever deeper we go. Attached to some kind of apparatus. I wonder what it does. An impressive setup. What is it for? I'm sorry, CEO. I don't know. My focus can't read the data here. What about the living ancestor? Is the data lost to her? Two, from two steps forward, one step back to two steps forward, one step sideways. Scan the device, if you will. You did this for him? You put, like, Please, all scan the in everyone's heads? Kenya, you, you mustn't judge me. I had no choice. If I said no, what would he do to us? What would he do to you? You're my little girl. I was trying to keep you alive. Tell me what, what your focus Dad? reveals about the device. Seriously, why? So we can be trapped in this underground nightmare? You know what we have to do. Please. Did you find a recording, Aloy? Yeah. I'll share it with you later. Scan the device, if you will. Made a minor adjustment to the gene therapy regimen and added a new cocktail to treat the symptoms caused by the mutations. Hopefully, there will be some stabilization after the next treatment. God knows what Ted will do to us if there isn't. The early results were so promising. No signs of aging, no cellular degeneration, but now... Oh, if only I had access to my old lab in Bangkok, or my old colleagues, or my old liquor cabinet. Stop it. Got to stay positive. Pacanya. You saw something. I could tell. Did the data explain what Pharaoh used this device for? 
I think he was undergoing treatments to live longer. A lot longer. Really? Could he still be alive? Don't be foolish. If he were alive, he would have kept his essence. It would not have been passed down to me. Remember, he was the renewer. Of course he would have stopped at nothing to grasp the secrets of life and death. But not for himself. Everything he did was for a new beginning. For us, for the yes, Quen. Yes, of course. And for his true heir, me. You know, I'm starting to think you're right. You do have a lot in common with Ted Farrow. I knew you would see in time. Let us continue. Not a compliment. His secrets await. Small office for a minor functionary, perhaps. I'm confused. Are we talking about Ted or CEO? Geothermal energy plant right under the city of San Francisco. A marvel. Even I can run it. And let's face it, I was always more of a visionary than an engineer. Which is why I had the foresight Look at all this to insist on the You're getting closer to the heart of a very this place. unique feature. Feel it. Just in case anyone ever tries to steal my cheese, so to speak. Core temperature 541 Fahrenheit, okay. Condition nominal. Base temperature 1876 Fahrenheit. That's warm, right? Pretty warm. Structural integrity low, core vulnerabil vulnerable. Any disturbance may trigger safeguard protocol. Well, he's Ted Faro, so break the door down. It's pretty much. I'm going to look for another way in. Good idea. It's worked before. Very well. Get to it. Is that a vent of some sort? Hurry! Break it open! Okay, I have a real question. Are the vents in USA really that big? In every movie, it feels like the vents are meant so that an army can go through. And in the games as well. Is there a building with vents so big? So I thought, my first time, the first time I was thinking about this was 
that old movie with Bruce Willis. Uh, Die Hard. Die Hard, that was the movie. He was moving around the vents of a huge building and I was like, that doesn't seem right. Sorry for himself. Less his future. Less his children. Someday they'll come, and I'll be here to greet them. Sometimes that my aging has stopped altogether. If anything, my cells are replenishing faster than normal. I just need some time for the mutations to calm down. Time. And energy. Sometimes if the reactor can give me what I need to grow strong again, to get my shit back together, so I can greet the kids. They're gonna need me. My advice. My guidance. And then I'll be alone that. anymore. secrets are they here uh, not the ones you're looking for then they my heart is good classic <laughs> trust me you don't want to go in there are you mad I haven't come all this way to stop now Legacy is mine. Burn it to ash. Wait, no. Pharaoh has it rigged to melt down if Kill them too. No witnesses. She's using the smoke!
start to overflow if he dies. We have to run. Oh. Oh, come on! Which way? This is the way the cookie crumbles. Oh. Oh. Okay, what is the way?
Ah. Mm. Come on, Aoi, you can jump better than that. If you have the higher ground, you're screwed. If you're on the lower ground, you're screwed.
Okay, have a nice time on the barbecue. I'll be done soon too. We found something that will help. Not just your homeland, but everywhere. But where's the CO? Oh, he's... gone. I guess you could say he gave his life to help us attain the secrets of Thebes. I see. You must think I'm eminently stupid. What? No. No. The CEO was an entitled egotist who twisted our beliefs into a sickening, self-serving fantasy. 
And you expect me to believe he sacrificed himself for scraps of data? It's time for the truth, and it better be convincing. Otherwise, I'll simply order these soldiers to open fire. Hold on. You're right. To be honest, the CO screwed everything up. He brought thieves down around our ears and died like a gutless coward. But... We really did find something down there that will help your homeland. If I can take it, and use it. Now, if I have to, I will fight my way out of here, but it doesn't have to be that way. You can just let me go. And then take credit when things start to improve. Success certainly does sound better than failure. It seems, then, that our destinies are intertwined. Landfall is open to you. If it will help your cause, you may come and go as you please. But Alva must join you and report back on your efforts. Fair enough. Thebes is of no further value to us. Obviously, we're going back to the flotilla. Alva. I expect your reports to be thorough. Oh, I thought he was going to have us killed. Oh, and instead, I get to join you. Glad to have you. But you're going to need a little help to reach our base. Varl, I made a new friend. I need you to meet her at the Quen Ferry and escort her back. On it. Can't wait to meet her. Trust me, you'll love it there. Varl will give you a better focus and all the data you could ever want. Head to the ferry. I'll join you back east as soon as I can. A diviner must follow the truth wherever it leads. I'll see you there. Now that I have Omega Clearance, we should have what we need to capture Hephaestus. But before I head to the ferry, maybe I should stop by Landfall. With the CO gone, maybe more Quen will be willing to talk. Might be worth looking around the island, too. I gotta change out of these clothes. I can't believe the CO made me play dress up.
Okay. I'm gonna wrap it up here. Thanks for watching and have a nice evening or afternoon.